Well, this is a special time of year in the European footballing cycle. It's where it all begins again. The lifting of the trophy, the winners' medals. That was all back in May. A mere reminder, a wreck of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps, for one of these. So red and white, of course, the preeminent colours at Old Trafford, which is now officially the largest club football ground in England. Its capacity, 75,000 and growing. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. We hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. So it's down to business here. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Casemiro. He gives them some real defensive steel in the middle of the park, Peter. What he's put... And the shots! Oh, Manchester United! And what a start! Jim, your thoughts? Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think... You have to give credit where it's due, and it was a brilliant setup and finish. Borussia Dortmund didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. Bruno Fernandes, and the finish! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. I think he still deserves full marks for making his way through it was a it was a cracking run